Welcome back to Fox News Black Report. Well, historically, the barriers that kept black folks from entering the architecture profession were rooted in racist laws and policies, but one woman is pushing to change that, as we still represent mm -hmm. only a tiny fraction of those who design the spaces around That's us. That's right, now she's amazing. Her name is Pascal Sablin. She graduated with a Bachelor of Architecture degree from Pratt and earned a Master's in Architectural Design from Columbia University. She serves as president of the National Organization of Minority Architects and became the youngest African-American inductee of the AIA College of Fellows for exceptional work and contributions to architecture. Nicole, like she did that at the age of 38. Wow, mm -hmm. wow, look at her. To help get students interested, uh, Sablon founded Beyond the Built Environment, a platform dedicated to amplifying the work of people of color. Yeah. You go, girl. This is uh, incredible. You know, in in uh, in college, one of my college roommates, uh, Al Gramena, mm -hmm. who is an architect today. Mm -hmm. I remember when he was studying architecture at USC, mm -hmm. and it ain't easy, mm -hmm. you know. And it's not the most lucrative career, particularly and it takes a very long time. At, a, at an entry level point. That's right. Uh, and so it's not for the faint of heart. It's not, you know. But the fact that that she's leaning into this, mm -hmm. um, and more than that. She is creating opportunity for yeah. other black architects and architects yeah. of color. That's what it's all about. That journey is just as rigorous as becoming like a medical doctor. If I can remember the stats, there's over just over 120,000 architects. Uh, less than 3,000 are black and less than 600 are black women. Mm -hmm. So um, she has definitely accomplished uh, much against the odds. Uh, and the fact that she is creating a legacy that archi black architects to come can live in is absolutely amazing as well. That's right.